G'day guys and girls and welcome back to our little channel, Goodies Beer Reviews. And a little bit something different, just for tonight to sneak one in after I just uploaded a review. Tis Tuesday. Oh man, got a few things on this week, but what I've got today is the most boring bottle, unless you get excited over Cooper's bottles. Look, this is a pale lager bladder kit so all in brewing i don't know how to tag people i don't care but look all in brewing pale lager so i just i love brewing from scratch but you know sometimes we, we're busy so instead of your simple can or extract let's let that car go by um you know instead of the simple can or extract you get the bladder kit Put it in a fermenter and just follow the instructions. Generally seven to ten days and it's ready to bottle. With a couple of sugar things or seven grams of sugar. Odd. I added seven grams of sugar per bute here. This one a bit less because I just got the dregs. So this is the dregs of an all-in brewing pale lager. And when I mean the dregs, oh, very aggressive kiss on the can. That's good carbonation, you'd hope. I would have left this another ooh, week, but I just was excited because I know it's going to be carbonated by the squeezy squeeze of the bottle. Look, it looks good. All in brewing bladder kit, pale lager. Look, it just looks dirty. It's a dirty lager. Unless you're going to cold crash it again and all that. It dissipates a bit quick, but that's probably because of me. So, forgive. Look, I've had a little sniffy poo of this before, and I smelt. And I'll tell you again. You get this, you get a bit of a sour smell. And you think this actually, if you close your eyes, I think it smells like a sour beer. Unless it's just the very young days of this maturing you've got to leave it a few weeks my advice is if you keg if you keg a week a week to 10 days you're getting optimum carbonation if you just sit it on say 10 or psi or a bit less anyway shut up goody. let's go yeah that's nice <laughs> Holy moly. Like, for the simplicity of these things, and they might not be for some, but just follow the instructions. Get a good fermenting vessel, pour the bladder in. Throughout some stages, depending on the type of beer you have, you'll have to add some hops. And if you don't want it real chunky, just put it into a different vessel and leave it in a fridge for a day, 24 hours. And that's called cold crushing to get all your stuff. This is their pale lager. Like I said, my carbonation is low because of the life choices I've made. But I just was excited to show you this. Um, and I will do another review when it's matured. But this is just nice. If you pay 50 55 for the bladder. Now this had no extra hops added to it. So it had SARS and... Oh, Mordeen or some other hop in the bladder. So all you need is your yeast. Yeah, it's my carbonation is low. I'm still getting a bit of tinkle. But that, look, all in brewing, I've had their hazy IPA. I've had a couple of their bladders and they're just simple. And when you've got a lot on, you throw it in the hopping's done, and all I can say is sterilise your gear. Sterilise the gear. Because if you sterilise, your it's a big thing. Clean and sterilise. Look, I'm going to enjoy this. I'm going to give this another five days, and then I'll review it again. Um, so I'm sorry about the boring video, but all in brewing, all I can suggest is, if you like... Yeah, the black, they're just so easy. They're just so easy. And if you do them properly, 
and really monitor it, you get a good result. All grain brewing is your next step and it's just, it can be very frustrating but very rewarding. Believe me, my Nipah, whew, I've got to properly review that. Mm. Look, I'm going to leave this bit out because people will say that looks flat. And like I explained, I did maturely review this because I was so excited, even though it is a little bit fizzy wizzy. But yeah, don't worry about that because it tastes sensational. A lager, it's pale. This comes in at about, I think it was 4.8. I'll have to check the gravity rating. And at the end of the day, I don't really care that much. I'm not going out robbing a bank now. The teenager in the background is having a shower with his music, so it's going to drown me out. Mm. Anyways, I'll leave it at that. All in brewing. Hazy pale. The picture will be on the start or the thumbnail of the video, whatever the fuck they call it. You know what, it's Tuesday. Fuck it. All in brewing. Do it to save time and effort and stress and to impress your friends because they're pretty good packs. Love each other, be kind to each other, take care of each other, and I will see you at the next one, which will be grifted from the parts of Dub Vegas. I promise you it will be a revisit to our best friend, our happy place, Bolter Easy Hazy. Peace. Love each other.